So, if there's one thing anybody knows about me, it's that I am a very gullible person. Nope. And I was on a road trip with a bunch of other guys that liked to screw with me a good chunk of the time. Because I've never met anyone who likes to screw with you. So near the end of our trip, before we, um, you know, crossed back over the Canadian border to come back into America, uh, we stopped at this, we stopped at this gas station, and one of the guys went in and he got, uh, he got a pack of cards, and he said to me, "Oh, by the way, James, these cards, they're they're illegal." I'm like. What? He's like, they're, they're illegal. We actually can't bring these back into America. Oh, wait, no, they, it wasn't a deck of cards. It was poker chips. Poker. He called them French poker chips. French poker chips. Because, <laughs> you know, we were in Canada. Yeah. So, <laughs> so no. he said, yeah, no, the, these, you cannot bring these into America. Like, you know, you can't bring alcohol across the border. You can't bring the, these poker chips across the border. I'm like, okay, you, you've been with me this whole trip. I'm, I'm not falling for this. Whatever. Th there, there was a small part of me that was falling for yeah, it, but yeah, I was yeah. like, okay, no, no, no. You didn't no. want to turn him now? Turn up the bullshit meter. They, they're probably screwing with me. The, of, of course, they all joined in on the act, and they were like, yeah, yeah, they're illegal. I'm like, okay, sure, whatever. So, we get to the Canadian border, uh -huh. and one of us, um, let's call him K, K decides to bring a bottle of alcohol mm -hmm. across the border. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, once we get there, the the guard at the border, she checks the back of the tr of the car. Yeah. She opens the trunk, yeah. and there's the bottle of alcohol. She's like, yeah. oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So she ends up bringing us inside. What? And, and we're all worried. Yeah. Because, like, I've never been in this situation before. I had no yeah. idea if it was, like, a big deal or not. Mm -hmm. uh, everybody else seemed a bit worried, too. And I was like, oh, jeez, what's going to happen? One of, one of the guys was, like, making jokes, like, oh, they're going to have to check our They're going to have to look up our and make sure we're not smuggling illegal drugs or whatever. And I was like, oh, jeez, okay. I was, so we were all getting kind of scared. I was scared, too. And I was like, oh, jeez, what's going to happen? I, I lean over to the guy who told me about the French poker chips. Let's call him Jay. I say, Jay, if, if she asks us about anything, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to tell him the truth about the French poker chips. <laughs> <laughs> and he, he just starts laughing. He's like, James, I was totally f***ing with you the whole time. I was like, oh, god dang it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like, he, he told me, holy <laughs> James, I was like r really afraid during that whole time. I'd never been stopped at a border before. You saying that made it a lot better. <laughs> that made the whole situation much happier. I'm like, okay then, cool. Dude, that's hilarious. <sighs> Freaking <laughs> French poker chips. <laughs> oh my god, dude. <laughs>